Cybertron now at 1-800-SLEEP-OFF-LARD or visit www.sleepofflarge.com and sleep your way to a thinner, happier you. In today's fast-paced world, a split second can be the difference between achieving your dreams Hey, I just want to know about Feast Ride! and not. More Americans are Welcome, everybody. The latest and greatest technological devices you yeah. will fall behind. What, you can't hear me speaking? Oh. Oh shit, I forgot about this mission. I forgot to find out where the last package is. Right, just uh. Am I streaming? Am I streaming? Did you say? Yeah, I'm watching it now. Oh right, yeah, yeah. Just uh, I'm just watching this YouTube video to find out where that last package is. I'm just watching the YouTube video to find out where the last thing is. Because I don't want to do the mission and then get to the end and mission failed again. So, right, he's missed that one. Why have you missed that one? Bear with me, lads. Kiff on, man. Kiff on. Gonna be a good stream, isn't it? Please. I look at it. You what? That was my cat. I was only sure you could tell me about that one, eh? Fair. Right, bow me. He's missing loads of packages. Why is he missing loads? Mm. Right, so now he's got to the area of where I got to. Mm. Oh, right, okay. Right, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah I get it. Mm. So we checked straight, we checked left, but we didn't check right, and you have to go right. Rushing to the mall or talking on my cell phone, I know me and my family are safe. 
The Maibatsu monstrosity has four-wheel drive, and in amphibious mode, it can cross rivers. So far, I've only hit a few puddles. But it's good to know it's there. With the time I save taking shortcuts through the strip mall parking lot, I can focus on the important things, like gazing longingly at the pool boy or buying more exercise equipment off the TV. So no. worth it gets three oh, miles to the gallon. Oh, fuck's sake. Mom, not a conservationist. The new Maibatsu monstrosity... Oh, because I fucking didn't turn right into the park quick enough. Would you like a giraffe? Have one delivered. Just log on to PexOvernight.com and we'll send you a giraffe overnight. Yeah, PexOvernight.com, delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. All right, you are listening to Chatterbox, hosted by me, Laszlo, because I got kicked off the rock right, station. Laszlo. Let's go over here and talk to somebody about their life. Hello, caller, you're on the air. Hi, Leslie. My name's Martha. I just love your show. I always so I've put the GTA San Andreas talk with Laszlo. What about the GTA 3 talk with Laszlo? Oh, I used to love this mission. Leave us alone for a minute. I don't know. See you soon. See you around. Stretch. This is what we do, kid. Yo, hey, yo, 68 and screens. DVD, naked on the couch. What? With two feet of me. The rap game treating me, giving me blessings. It's better than that whack, whack, whack. Depressing. You can find me up in trees at the summer league. And we eat against the wannabes. I'm on fire, be stretch. And who kid is in the front row? Iced out, not even watching the game. We want, you know, the type that I holler first at your thirst, master. Too fly, we curse at you. Walk on by, boo. My sunshine's turning to clouds. I'm the reason behind shootouts. Murderous styles in the bridge. Cool out, my is wow. At award shows, I spit in the crowd. On your girlfriend wig. Meet again because the world ain't big. Oh, shit. Sorry, man. I was fucking in my own little world. I wasn't paying attention. Shit, man. I don't know why I did that. Sorry about that guys, we'll, uh, we'll do it proper this time. Talk too much, so I really can't tell if he likes me. 
Chatterbox, where your opinion matters, or at least we say that. Let's go over here to line four. Hello, caller, what's your name? There's a rally tomorrow evening at the park, starting at seven. Although we'll be painting banners and singing songs all night and all day to prepare for it. Then, when tens of thousands have gathered in the park, we're going to march on the town hall. Razzle, the people have spoken. They have said no, not in my town. So folks, if you're listening and want to make a difference, get yourself down to the park, prepared to bring democracy back to the people. So, uh, what's this rally about, Jeff? It's about people standing up and being counted. It's about the future. It's about telling those morons, no thing, not in my town. Not where I put the flesh in my body and hope in my soul. I will not, I cannot let this pass. L let what pass? It's about grabbing the town by the balls and saying, listen, son, time to put up or shut up. No more Mr. Nice Guy. No more easy solutions to difficult problems. It's about what it means to be an American. It's about giving something back. Giving what back, Jeff? Hope, dreams, belief. Belief in what? I mean, look, Jeff, I, I admire your passion. Really, I do. But what will people be marching for? What, what's your rally about? It's about justice, Mr. Lowe. A chance to shine and make a difference. About thousands of people walking side by side as brother marching. Only one thing on their mind. The chance to make a difference. Bring your friends. Nothing shows a man how much you mean to him more than the chance to walk together for justice. Bring your kids. They can paint signs, and we'll even have a face painter and a vegan barbecue. That's our little friend, Mr. Big Mouth himself. Were you followed? You know what goes on here is our little secret, I mean. No, no, I, I wasn't followed. You got my stuff? Here's your spank, Scooby. Now talk. Okay, so the Leones are fighting wars on two fronts. They're in a turf war with the triads, with no sign of either side giving up. Meanwhile, Joey Leone has stirred up some bad blood with the Forellis. Every day they're losing men and influence in the city. Salvatore is becoming dangerous and paranoid. He expects everybody and everything. And with loyalty like yours, what has he possibly got to worry about? <laughs> That's very true. Elderly care about that's whack curly bob. I'm just gonna turn them trails back off because I didn't realize it's actually fucking with And you haven't that. really told us why people should do this. What is it about? Look, look, do you want to help or not? I don't know what I'm helping. You're helping America. What kind of patriot are you? on in the show if you're into uh, health foods or martial arts we'll have a special guest just for you this guy's really special kind of like a romantic cruise but he can't walk on water all right let's go to the fu just realized i was running the wrong way oh it's not there no more that's it. There's normally a decent car there. Well, half decent. and get this mission out of the way with because uh, the hidden missions and I just like getting them out of the way because uh, yeah, I just some money and you know, get stuff done helps clear up the rest of the map so we don't have to come back apart from when we have to do a mission where it's mission come back I didn't feel the little dog just want to be in just a Scotland area Something a little cheaper, and my whole body smelling like Joe Babbage. I don't care, I got a bad habit. Try to fight.
say that I ain't even took a jab at it. Why quit? I love to talk. I love them. Is together. Wow, you're learning some real skills. How about the salary and benefits? Yesterday, I made a dollar. See, that's the kind of dedication we have to our employees and the quality of our shoes. Eris Running Shoes. Always running from something. Buying a gift for the guy that has everything? Log on to PetsOvernight.com. We've got exotic pets galore, including tigers, cobras, manatees, and white rhinos. <laughs> All delivered overnight. PetsOvernight.com. Delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. All right, now joining us in the studio, we have a very special guest. His new book, Karate and Digestion, has been on the top 100 self-help books for the past three weeks. He is the founder of Now and Zen Dojo and Organic Food Market in Trenton. His name is Reed Tucker. Welcome to Chatterbox, Reed. Why, thank you, Basil. It's certainly to be here today. So tell me, Reed, where did you think of the idea of combining martial arts and organic food? I mean, I mean it's kind of like putting ice cream on pizza. Both are great, but they really shouldn't be put together. So clearly, that's very nice. Nothing like ice cream and pizza. Ice cream is milk-based, as we all know, and I am lactose intolerant. And pizza, as you may know as well, is a sandwich derivative of Italian origins, but I won't go on. Martial arts are about discipline and physical empowerment, not watching football and eating junk food. You have to explore your mind and your digestive system, Laszlo. What you put in also comes out. <laughs> Especially corn. What's the story with that anyway? Laszlo, I'm deadly serious now. My mentor was a 430-year-old monk who showed me the way to enlightenment through character. Okay. If you have a question for Reed, we'll be taking the calls a little bit. I think we all went through a ninja period. You know, I had the Chinese stars and the nunchucks. This is not a period, Laszlo. This is a way of life. Thanks to a strict vegan diet, I had the power of nine men. After morning meditation and a three-bean salad, I could chop a bus in half. Meditation and after, yeah, all went in. <laughs> no offense, but you're kind of a scrawny, pasty dude. It, and it says on the inside cover of your book that you still live in your parents' basement. Okay, it's, it's not a basement. I prefer a center for spiritual enlightenment. In chapter 17 of my book, which I know... Hell no! This, in karate, means open hand, but it might as well mean open mind. If you're like wheatgrass, I think you're open hand. Well, I'm not a masticating cow, so I really don't enjoy chewing damp hay and prancing around in leggings, shouting, Hi ah! Okay, that though, I'm warning you this time, do not make me angry. It's bad for my karma, and it will definitely be bad for your karma. I studied the martial arts so I could stand up to bullies just like you, and I encourage everyone listening out there on Chatterbox to buy my book and learn how organic food and martial arts can help you too. <laughs> and I encourage anyone who needs a doorstop or booster seat to buy it as well. Let's see who's on the phones. Glad so. This is your final one. Going to my dragon's dance. <laughs> Hello, caller. You are on the air. Hello, Reed. I bought your book. It's really saved my life. Why, thank you. I wanted to ask about chapter 25. Yoga, not yogurt. You can't give up cheese. So, one more thing. I'm just going to talk about the chocolate and cats better add to my life. I'm just going to have my legs been behind my head for two days now. But my husband says I look like a chicken exorcist. I even put on the dairy on the top shelf of the fridge so I could drink it with my legs been behind my head now. But I grow weak and start talking to myself and doing it. What can I do? Do not fret, my child. We are all... No one behind there. Colors. Like you ever been downtown? Yo, baby, feel like that? Follows him back there. You're real smart. Oh, nearly clutched that then. That would have been a triad mission, I think. It's like a gang war thing. Yeah, so we've clutched the one up here. I'm pretty sure there's one up there. I just don't know how you get to it. So, I'm going to try and 
try and get this quickly and then if I can't get it I'll carry on with the missions. So dark. Yeah. Let me just uh, change my screen settings. Him on your knee one last time. Molto See, back in the day, on the PS2 version, there used to be a most wanted star there that you could collect. So you don't have to get rid of your, um, your cops. They used to come so handy, and then they removed it. Okay, the listener lines are open. This is Chatterbox. You're on the air. Oh, no. This mission. This is where I've got to find a triad van. I think, or it's one more I've got to take him to Chinatown. And I've got to um, and kill all the people with them. Big 
Wow, really? I killed the guy as well. For fuck's sake, I've just lost all them weapons. I had a fucking flamethrower and all sorts as well. Fuck you. I'm sorry guys, I know you've just been in a shootout and you probably want to listen to some gangster music, but right now, I think uh, me and my friends after being at the five just want to listen to some Laszlo. Well. Oh, all my guys are died. You kidding. Guns either. When I try this, you know what? Trust me, so trust is to other people away from the dreams. When I drop this, I'm not going to be running for me. You should do No, this part of the mission is hard. This is where I've got to find a try again. Second. Game man, not rugby hot dog. Man, get me in a scrum and I'm safe. I'll take anybody down. I'm the hot scotch master. I got fly skills, hot scotch. You know what I'm saying? Hey, yeah, I mean, I, I, I kind of see your point, but you know, you'd be a little cranky too if you I'm a man, so I'm telling all your friends off. Tell all the people about the MSN, I'm a loser. 
Alright, so I would normally go and get the armor. But this time I can bother. I think it would be any point where I just get it. So uh, instead, I'm just gonna go out. I'm just gonna risk it for a biscuit. I should have really took the one that I saw when I um, was first turning into the road where the station was just in the top. Oh, that's good. Sense of teamwork. My friend Joey sewed his hands together. Wow, you're learning some real skills. How about the salary and benefits? Yesterday, I made a dollar. See, that's the kind of dedication we have to our employees and the quality of our shoes. Eris running shoes, always running from something. Flashback. 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 Thank you for watching guys. Hope you're enjoying the stream. If there's anything that um, you want to see, you know, just drop it like, like in the comments or whatever. Oh well, you cut not um, Just where you want me to go, you know, if there's anything particular you want me to do on this game. If there's something you want to know, just, you know, ask me a question. I'm right in thinking we've got one more mission and then we'll be pushing on to doing the second island. Okay, I've had enough of this shit. We're gonna finish the triads in Liberty once and for all. Eight balls rigged a dust cart with a bomb. It's on a timer, so if you mess up, there'll be no evidence. Go and pick up the dust cart. Careful. Eight Ball says it's real sensitive, and the slightest bump could set that thing off. Their fish factory will open its gates for a dust cart, so you can drive right in. Park up between the gas canisters and get the hell out of there. I want it to rain. This is uh, quite an annoying mission. Oh, the driving part. Get out of my car! Careful, I got yells on! Hot tonight. 
Jazz is your bag. There's an all night jazz piece down the beach as well. War boss. Yeah, I'm doing them don't don't you? It's time to shake it up with me, Tony, here on Flashback. Flashback, flashback, flashback. Would you like a kitten? Have one delivered. Just log on to PetsOvernight.com and we... All right, speaking of brilliant, you're listening to Chatterbox with... We're here at KJ in Studio 2 because, you know, one love... Plus you one love, make two. So this is Studio Two. Oh, oh, oh. We double the love. I got that this. So when I do hard, 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 There's too much spank business in Guan. There's a hidden package.
The cartel has got bottomless funds from Yeah, but I can't read them straight away though because I have to open up on my phone. Yeah, I saw that, yeah. If you do this for me, you will be a made man. Anything you want. Go and see eight ball. You'll need I don't know. You, you, you can check it. I can't. I can't. Yeah, you press the little person thing and it shows you. I'm pretty sure it does. Liberty Tree will understand how important this next movement is to me. More than a mirror. Double flap that down. This is where we'll get uh, introduced into the cartel people. So I blow up, it's why we're blowing up the ship. Yo, my man. Salvatore phoned ahead, but a job like this is gonna need a lot of fireworks. I'll need a hundred thousand dollars to cover expenses. But you know with me, you get a lot of bang for your buck. Come back, brother, when you have the money. Well, we've got three hundred thousand, so let's do it. Okay, let's do this then. I can set this baby to detonate, but I still can't use a piece with these hands. Here, this rifle shall help you pop some heads. Do you remember this mission? <laughs> so I've got to be a lookout sniper over the top of the... on the roof. Right. While he progresses through. Sort of like a Metal Gear Solid sort of fucking technique where like you'd look over someone and they sort of push through. Anyway, enough of that stuff. Let's have a little oh, hard shit. dog. Now, what you say is you say please Aris, more dog, please. No fighting between man and man. Let your love grow strong. Kaja, up on night lock. I'm the pacifier. And this is from Green I am the pacifier. Hey John. Hey John. Hey, Get a good vantage point, then I'll head in when you fire the first shot. Yeah, get another trials of trails, but they're them little flat bits that are down there, don't they? You what? You know when you turn the trails on? Hmm. Yeah, did you want me to turn them off? So you don't want it like this, where the graphics look better. Oh, I hate it where it's like that. Turn it back on. You prefer it widescreen, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Do you? Mm, depends, really. The graphics are better when it's not widescreen, but I prefer it being widescreen because I'm getting the full coverage of my TV. Bar and the little black bar going around the outside. Alright, I've got to remember how to do this now. So, zoom in, zoom out, up, down, left, right. Right, okay. So if I'm right in thinking, I've got to shoot this guy first. Then I've got to shoot this guy. Then I'll make my way up here. Shoot that guy. Shoot that guy.
shooting this barrel. I don't need to. Yeah. Cleaned it out now. Called everyone. Nice and easy, on it? The sniper's control on this game though is horrible because uh, the controls. It wouldn't be old school controls. Yeah, do it. I'd love that. What? Alright. That's agreed. And there we go, mate. That's our introduction to the cartel. Now oh, I've got a cartel cruiser as well. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna speed this way for a bit. Oh, well, actually, while I'm here at the dock, I totally forgot. I'll go and collect some armor. You what, sorry? Armor. May as well collect it while I'm here because I forgot about it. I don't think this vehicle's accepted here, but I'll try it. No, they're not interested in that model. Playing on me, I mean, I well, I can't hear what's on, but very vaguely. You know, I think that's a less Drive a car like this, mate. It's gonna have to be reggae music, innit? You can just imagine it, car here, just cruising down the street and that, hot box with this music blasting out. Yeah. I thought that was a real good detail. That. For new and used emergency vehicles. All oh, right, okay, yeah. So they're wanting emergency vehicles now. It's my and then this is where he tries to get me killed, Salvatore. Because now that I've taken out the cartel, the only competition he's got is me. Because uh, obviously I've got all the information on everyone. It's head radio. 
Yeah, no, the Mafia. Well, I thought he was with Yeah, but obviously he fucking told me I'm going to be a made man after I do that job for him and take out the cartel. But I've taken out the cartel and because he knows that I know everything, and because obviously I've done a lot of jobs for a lot of people in the area, he wants to get rid of me so there's fucking there's no witness and no fucking evidence. Well, well, yeah, he's trying to set me up, isn't he? He wants me to go pick up this car, this is his last request. He wants me to... No, I said that's our introduction to the cartel. Meaning, that's our fucking introduction into the cartel coming onto the game. So here we go, look. So basically, I was supposed to get in that car, because he wanted it delivering. But really, there's a bomb in the car, so that as soon as I get in, I'm, I'm dead. He's setting me up to obviously kill me, so that was no evidence, no witnesses. So, what do you do then? So, because Salvatore's bird knew about so it, you in it, that I'm getting a hit, yeah. She's told me to go to the docks down here. And does it actually show you the camera? So, if you got in it, it actually blew up. Yeah, and then it says mission failed. The car, the car blew up. Because obviously a lot of people would get into the car too quick. Because if you don't check your page at the top corner, which is where it showed it. And you've got to check your page at the top. Yeah, she says to you, she's like, um, don't get in the car, come and meet me at the docks, blah blah blah. So I've met her and now she's taking me to Staunton Island. So yeah, we're on the second island now. Is that true? Do you be friendly with Cartel or are they your enemy on the way through? Who? Cartel. Cartel, yeah, they're my enemy. Everyone's my enemy in this game. I'm trying to take everyone out. Yeah. So we've fought against the triad. Are this Delvacars against you now? Isn't it? We've fought against the triad. Oh, we're going to fight totally against... Good. Fucking. Well, Tony's part of the fucking mafia, isn't he? I thought he was your brother. To... Asuka, no, that's fucking eight ball. You need a place to lie. Eight balls are black. There's a warehouse at yeah. the edge of Belleville that should be here. Yeah, yeah. Come back no. here to my condo when you're ready. <laughs> you and me can have a chat. So basically, now I'm working with the Yakuza. So I've taken out the triads. The mafia are after me, and I'll eventually take them out. And now I'm working with the Yakuza. Yeah. So now let's go to our uh, thingy. <laughs> our new safe house. News just in from the there we go, desk. mate. On the news now on the car. It's now saying uh, bridge is fixed. Have been yeah. the clock to get right, now I know there's a hidden package. Kitten overnight. Petsovernight.com. Delivering little That's bundles right. of love in a box. Tween song to a station your parents warned you for commercials. Jeez. 
new pot. New pot's just near us. So what cars do we need now? Security car, mm -hmm. flatbed, line runner, trash master, a bus, a dodo, a rumpo. You mean a coach? A bus, a coach, mate. No, I've already took the coach. Oh, where's it? What? Where's it? Say bus? Oh, yeah. Have you heard of Grand Vivar Independence City? What? Dang it. Oh, what the fuck is it? Dunno, Independence City. Sounds like a game someone's made. Fair. Said that they're bringing back all the maps. What all of them to get like in that? So basically, um, you can go. Well, it's not classed as San Andreas, it's classed as Los Santos now. What is it going to be fat or old? Uh, I'm not sure. But basically, from, from what I've heard, you start off the game as a low time drug dealer and a thug. And you're working your way up the ranks basically, and you're becoming like a proper mob boss. Mm. Like, yeah, but, um, what about so you start you off doing. To him. Listen, so you start off doing dodgy jobs in uh, Los Santos, and then you have to fly out to Vice City, and that's how you start becoming a drug uh, a drug dealer. So you become a drug dealer in Vice City, and then you go to um, what do you call it, Portland, and all that, which is this map. Okay. Liberty. Liberty City, yeah. What do you fly about? Yeah, you fly to Liberty City, yeah. Can you fly to the other one when you're on a free run after the campaign or something? You what, sorry? Can you, do you know, can you fly fly to previous hours to revisit? Well, it'll be open world, just like normal. Cool. Right, so where's the marker for the bridge? I don't know, man. Right. Yeah, there we go. So, uh, I think I'm on the bridge. You think or you stink? Hold on, let me work it out. Sorry, <laughs> my second. Right, no, so I was on the bridge. There we go, now I'm on the bridge. So I just need to wait for it to lift up. Why? You know what? Why? Because when the bridge lifts up, there's a hidden package at the top. Can we get on? Yeah. I can't wait to see it. How's it going? I've got to wait for the cars to stop though. I'm hoping these cars stop now, because if the cars stop... Michael Hunt. Last 
Might be because I'm still on the break. break. That's all. I'll fuck him off it. Like, I promise you, the bridge does look up. Well, before it used to come up quite frequently. Yeah. Well, you just have to wait for it to go down. It only goes up like 10 seconds. Maybe 15. Mm -hmm. Why is it not doing it? Because I've got to work. Until it advances in the game. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a fucking oh my god, I'm going the tempest by There's the Yakuza car. Right. Say another oh, no, sabotage. Sorry, mate. Yeah, I don't need to. Uh, yes. Why are you calling in today? Because I need some advice, and I ain't doing any of that trick shit. Oh, you're still here again. Salvador. We're gonna have to cut you off. This you is are. a family show. You're still Salvador. I'm not gonna do it, boy. I think I have got to kill him. Yeah. I think I've got to blow his um his car up, his limo. Maybe after I've, after I've done this mission, actually, that bridge work. Like. The bridge has only just been fixed. Uh, okay. We're gonna vibe up to the stream again and vibe up. Let's see if this will come with you. Let's see if this will come with you there. Yeah, well, well. I mean, sir, you know, in life we have a lot of obligations, and we just kind of have to face up to them. And right now, I'm obligated to play some commercial announcements. We'll be back right after this. We've got a new friend for everyone. He's got fur and a tail. He gets in lots of trouble, but he's a bouncy little fellow, because he's got springs for legs. Pogo the Monkey, the best new video game for the whole family. I love you, Pogo. You bound. Help Pogo escape from the evil research laboratory where the mean old scientist genetically altered him. Uh oh, the pharmaceutical scientist is going to get you, Pogo. Hey, you look up with the animal. Here you go, Pogo. Have a gold coin. Yeah. Good thing Pogo has a wow. banana cannon. Those nasty scientists deserve to die. Now get the shampoo manufacturers before they squirt it in your eye. Here you go, Pogo. Kind of right, you? I think there's no sky Including saving Timmy. Oh, well, there is. I'm sure you know. Oh. Even close. Do you come look up? Oh, I thought you meant while he was in the car. Come and help Pogo to his final mission. To storm the White House with his friends and become President of the United States. <laughs> Pogo the Monkey is the game kids are sure to stare at for hours. Everyone loves Pogo. Idiot Gamer called Pogo the best spring and city in games. Here we go, five seconds. Buy the game Pogo the oh. Monkey today. Right, Pogo? Oh, and coming soon, Pogo the Monkey card game. Pogo the Monkey plastic dolls. Pogo the Monkey quilt covers and Pogo the Monkey car covers. For the dad who wants everything, why not a Pogo the Monkey tie and sports jacket? For the lady in your life, why not Pogo the Monkey chocolate and hygiene? Where's the mafia? They should be here at 7 o'clock. And for kids, a life-size living, breathing, not eight screen monkey. All available at PogoTheMonkey.com. Alright, Liberty City, this is your talk radio show, Chatterbox, where your opinion matters. Let's go to the phones. Hello, caller, you're on Chatterbox. Hey, you ever had possum? That's good eating. Nah. 
really can't say I have. Well, you don't try it sometime. I tell you, man, it's good eat. Hot. Fuck's sake, Quirley. Wow. A cop crashes into me and I'm getting done for it. He's you taking the piss. Branch of the Don't Russian Mafia. Um, actually, I can't say that I do. But, but if I did eat too much squirrel and put on a few extra pounds, what is it he I says again on it? The Bradford branch like of the exercise machines that require you to be awake. The actually exercises. They don't say Russian Mafia, do they? Yeah. I've tried everything. Wow. That's because that, that's because I won't been fuck, I won't paying attention. Man, I was fucking what do you call it? Oh, let you get off and pay attention, I'm all about help. Yeah, man. Uh, you ring me in like, I don't know, half an hour or something, mate. You ring me. Alright, I'll take it easy, too. That's fun, see you around. I'll show you stream. See you soon. That's fun. Yeah, there was not a chance that I was gonna um, run on that way. It's quite a far distance, I think. Alright. I can make a thing in the head back here. Sorry, I skipped it again. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sure I'm not skipping Knights and maidens oh so fair are ready to delight you with tales of the Black Death, witch burnings, and the joys of being a feudal serf. Forget about air conditioning and modern medicine. We've got all the leeches, spells, and potions you need at the Medieval Millennium Fair. Learn the art of cooking with turnips. Yum, yum. By genuine reproduction medieval artifacts, including... Bobo, I thought all those radio people had faith. Do you have a question or you just want to sit here and talk all day about my name? No, that's it. Love the show, Lazlo. Or Mark. Or John. Or Bessie. Whatever your name is. All right, next caller, you're on Chatterbox. What is on your mind? Burnips. Fruit vegetables. Albino carrots as they're known back home. Okay, here's the deal. This isn't gardening with Maurice. Oh. That's on later. No, he that? got taken off the air. He lied. I know he did. I've been trying to make a hybrid of a peach and a Pekingese midget fight bitch for the last two years. And it is impossible. Impossible, I tell you. Okay, and speaking of impossible, Jane from Cedar Grove is on the line, and she wants to talk about how difficult it is being a parent today. Hello, Jane. Hi, Laszlo. I love the show. I'm a first-time caller. I wanted to say something about these video games. They are warping our kids' minds. My son's dog, Hugo, got hit by a truck, and he says, Mommy, Mommy, where's the reset button? Kids these days, they think it's like a game. Well, it's not a game, Laszlo. It is very, very serious. I let my kids play video games, and now he runs around the house... We'll do it proper this time. We'll pack up. Uh, where was I? 
I used to park up. Oh, hold on. Right, but this show does. I love that button. You know, it's never a dull moment on this show, especially if you're in our key demographic. Yeah, I love media, right. bringing people and the finest in entertainment together. All right, hello, next caller. You're on Chatterbox. I want to talk about that bag stuff. People say it's bad for you. It's not bad for you at all. Why are you talking? Oh, you think I'm strange? Am I on the air? Hello? Answer me, you pansy. What's your question? Bank, bank, bank. Bank. Spank. What about it? I mean, that's not really a question. Questions usually start spank, with words like spank, spank. how and why. Spank. And they end with your voice going up like this. Don't mock me. And the end I know of your voice going like this. Like How's that? All right, it's evil, dude. And toothpaste, they use it to control us. Why do you think all the commercials tell you to brush it twice a day? I've read books. And what book have you been reading that tells you that toothpaste is evil? Tetris, The Devil, and The Great Cavity Cover-Up by J. Phil Higginbottom. If you've seen what I've seen, and if you've heard what I've... Uh, I suppose you're one of those people that says that diet soda makes you go crazy later in life. I told you before, man. Don't mock me. My taxes pay your salary, you pansy. Yes, sir, uh, this is a commercial radio station owned by Love Media. Advertising revenue pays my salary. And on that note, it's been two full minutes since a commercial. But I'd like to say, if anyone else is stressed, might I recommend Equinox from Zaibatsu Pharmaceuticals? We'll be back after these important messages. Hello! I used to be concerned and nervous about the future. Sometimes I'd get scared before an important event such as childbirth or a family funeral. Hey, sometimes you need a little help navigating life's trouble spots. That's when I discovered Equinox. After the divorce and losing little Tommy, life was getting me down. I couldn't focus on anything at work. After trying Equinox, I've been employee of the month three times in a row. I used to fall unconscious for hours at a time. Now with Equinox, I never need to sleep. Equinox is new from Saibatsu Pharmaceuticals. Ask your doctor about Equinox today. Equinox makes much less of sleep. Work vision, image, kidney problems, and behavioral irregularities. Not take Equinox if you're operating in a machinery, driving car, brand new job, brand new job, you're having family history, mental disorders. Equinox, softening life's harsh realities. Tonight, the TV event will make history. Liberty City Survivor. Takes reality TV to a whole new level. We'll take 20 recently paroled guys, equip them with grenade launchers and flamethrowers, and let them hunt each other down. It's the reality show where you just might be part of the action. I was grabbing a sandwich at the Happy Blend, and all of a sudden these guys crashed through the window and started shooting at each other. I was so excited, I didn't even notice I'd been hit. After that, I was hooked on Liberty City Survivor. I watch it every day in the hospital. The game doesn't end until there's only one man left standing. Oh my god, Salvatore is dead. Save myself in the long run when I go back to Stunt Island. But before we do, I'm just going to have to try and um, Take it away, get an emergency bring it vehicle for the Mr. Scientist. thing. Yeah. It's a scrap. Come on. Here we go now! I know I've gone totally the wrong way. So I'll go over there. Hello. What do you mean? Yeah, so it'll be the game volume then. It's 
Just bear with me. So, can you hear me now properly? Right, so what about now, like while I'm driving? Like, can you hear me now? What is it? Alright, hang on then. When I walk, yeah. I was trying to set his vehicle on fire, but it just won't set on fire for some reason. You up? Sound like a robot. that van that's normally around there. Ugh, I'm gonna have to run to the car park, aren't I? Give him a cop car. Um, I'll go and give him. Yeah, I forgot the fire station. You are. I couldn't hear you over there. Fire engine's not there now. I bet that's because I've completed this island. But it's going to be a rarity now. This is Andy. Playing all the best music on the Lips 106 Expressway to Hot Music. Sorry guys, I didn't mean to do that. I'm not want to move far.
back to Kid Diamond and Bullet. Kid Diamond's cardiac arrest or organ failure or major hemorrhage. A small piece of metal ain't the problem. Besides, I only use my machine gun in the safety of my own home and car. I ain't hurting nobody. And countries that don't have guns ain't American. Y you know, that's a really good point. The countries that don't have guns aren't American. You know, if more people had guns, we'd have less shootings in this country. <sighs> All right, we're going over here to line two. Hello, caller. You are on Chatterbox. Yeah, I'd like to say something about taxes. You mean the Lone Star State? Oh, taxes. Well, you know, look, taxes are really wrong. My father worked his whole life. He played the lottery. And now the state wants to pay taxes on the money he wins from that stuff? Buy your own lottery ticket. You know, hey. Good point. I think that's a lesson to us all. All right. Hello. You are on Chatterbox. Hello, lads. Now, I'm a first-time caller. I live to the city from Hampshire in England. Oh, really? How do you like it? I mean, is it hard to get used to the language? You, you speak English pretty good. Oh, thank you, lads. Yes, yes, I, I do like it. There's one thing, though, that is very difficult, rather worrying. When I was a boy in England, I had a nanny. She was very good, lads. Yeah, well, I mean, there's excellent child care here in America. I don't know. Well, well, I'm sure. The thing is, Laszlo, when, when, when I was a naughty boy, I, 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 I would get spanked. Na nanny, Nanny would spank me when I was naughty. And now, now Freddy needs Nanny, because when Freddy's naughty, he needs to get spanked. Well, there's some child psychologists who probably say that spanking can be harmful to a child's emotional development. Ab ab absolute rot, Laszlo. It's lovely. Freddy needs a Nanny. He needs a Nanny, Laszlo, because Freddy's been a very naughty boy. H how old is your son? How old is your son? I don't have children. I can't stand the little brat. But I'm ready. He needs a nap. All right. That hey, you like my watch?
fucking great. A fucking shotgun sets my car on fire. Pleasure to welcome Fernando Martinez, who it says here is the founder of Fernando's New Beginnings, a revolutionary new way of saving your marriage. Fernando, welcome. The pleasure is mine, Lasso. It is an honor to be here. I feel that. Ah, uh, thanks. So tell me about Fernando's New Beginnings. Truly, Lasso, it is a miracle, a blessing. It is a revolution in the marriage guidance. For my people, oh, marriage the boss. is, how to say, sacred. The bond between the father and the child. Oh, wow. Are you actually kidding me? Do you know what I mean? Uh, I think so. For my people, it is the holiest, most sacrosanct thing imaginable. It's like a church. Yet, for it to be a happy marriage, it must also be like a brothel. The woman, she must be many, many arts. Be skilled in making house, cooking, changing the diapers on the babies. And she must also be a whore. A victim in the bedroom. Imaginative, exotic, constant. It is impossible. You change diapers and then you are a French maid? Fernando thinks not. Fernando knows not. Well, I mean, you know, it's an age-old problem. I mean, how do you keep the excitement in America? Excitement, exactly. Passion, danger. How, Laszlo? How? Tell me how, and I give you a big, big kiss. Like I give a woman. But I am not going to give you a big kiss. Not a kiss like I give a woman or even a donkey. Because, because you do not know. Well, I mean, in this case, ignorance uh, kind of seems like bliss. I, I wasn't really up for kissing on air. I mean, why not? Ask me? Am I not attracted? Am oh, I not God, this is impossible. Well, no matter. Why all this talking about this? I mean, watch it, asshole. Salvatore's death comes as all right. So we've got six minutes thirty. What's it we've got to do? I've totally forgot now. I don't know why I didn't watch cuts in. Anyone 
for pretty much anything, and you'll probably win, or at least get a settlement. At the firm of Rakin and Ponser Personal Injury Attorneys, we can show you how falling down and howling like a sissy can result in a large damage award from your employer. We also specialize in normally injuries suffered in auto, bus, and train accidents, and can even train you to normally. throw yourself in front of a bus and pretend to be injured. Hey, that's why they pay for insurance. Call the law offices of Rakin and Ponser and get ready to enjoy a life of luxury. Come on, don't do this to me. This mission's a bust. I have to wait for the time to run out. Laying on your lap, game radio, you listen to Lord Sales, Puerto Rican. Oh, for fuck's sake, uh, yes. <laughs> Featuring Black Rob, check it out. Saw me running through, gun inside the space school. Saw what the Alright guys, we're just gonna have a two minute break just so quickly. A report has been nosing around. Get Marie and I have taken a little holiday together until you can get rid of this perverted boy. He's probably out in the bay as you read this. 
steal a police boat and sink his career. Oh god, I hate this mission. And I've not even got much ammo either. Hello. Yeah, man. Not a lot, really. Nothing. I'm just uh, going on a five minute break to go make myself a drink. So fucking hell. It's my handsome handyman. Maria is all tied up. I'm trying to get a father for if I take like, oh, just leave it on if you want the father. Huh. Well, else? He's not thinking of marriage bay, he's thinking about where well, you think you might do pretty as well. Yeah. Stop what you think. Go on. Mm. But Laszlo, what if you act on your fantasy for your little secretary with the short skirt and pretty eyes? Go be Hiller, go there, smile, and what then, my friend? What then? Um, I get a sexual rap. When you were funny, bro. You are lucky, my friend. But you Sounds like it's real. No pause on your number. Your sweetheart, she hates you. Your pretty secretary, she wants you to be her man. You How long are you streaming for? Like another 40 minutes? You oh. and a thousand no, men no, like no. you. For me, once it was so. No, no, but no. then one day, I was driving my car. Well, what long do you want to do it for? West Belleville Park. <laughs> Wait, what? Why has the phone not disappeared? Marriage first, and you don't put the man first. Maybe we call it man marriage. Then I think to myself, no, this is a bad name. 
The phone's not gone on to the next one. And I can't remember the words of us. So how does this work? It is a miracle, Lazo. A miracle. A man is a good father, a loving husband, the winner of bread, six and a half days a week. And the spare half day, I save his life. How? By giving him what he needs. And they can roll in my well, this is Belleville Park. <laughs> what, with you? That kind of sounds like yeah, a little bit more. Yeah, you sound to yourself, you'd pretty much just expect real quick, man. But no, not with me. Well, you I think for a passion for mm. love, passion for women, which he can take home to his wife, of course. What, so you act like a pimp? Not a pimp, little man. A savior. In a control environment, I reintroduce the man to a pleasure he has lost, to the miracles of the world. And truly, the results are remarkable. With yeah, I'm not the past, but well, there's no problem. A thousand marriages have been saved, and a million more could be saved every day. <laughs> and, and do the wives know about this? In their hearts last low, How did I do this when I was a kid? They have been saved. Uh, well, how did okay. I do it last time I played it? We're gonna open it up to the phones if you've got any questions for must Fernando be Martinez, exotic marriage guidance made easy. Ring us now. Hey, oh, that's cool. We have a caller on line one. Caller, you are on... Yeah, it must be a glitch. I'm just gonna have to wait for the mission failure. Watch it, asshole!
A lot of them, we are now back. He's still out there. What? I'm back then, okay, honey? What? That's over here. They said he's still on the stairs now. No, I'm back in jail. Oh, alright. I'll be back in a second. Oh, you know what? This is him, Radio Love. I'm going to go with Pablo's gun, dude. I'll be back. Maybe over five minutes, don't be. I'll let you take a minute. Do you want to know why? I'm on domination and that's why it's, well, the end of his money. It's on 183. I'm going to be able to back with it. Is it fucking? Is it out? Is it fucking? He's working for Kenji. Nice. Did I miss him? My sister speaks highly of you, though I'm yet to be convinced that a guy Jin can offer anything but disappointment. Perhaps you could help deal with the situation that has me at a disadvantage. Of course, failure has its own disgrace. Ah, uh, just called me a guy Jin. is in custody awaiting transfer for trial. He is a valued member of the family. Break him out of custody and get him to the dojo at Bedford Point. Let's go. Down with another help. Steal a cop car. Oh. Right, it's literally over now. I'll be back in literally 20 seconds. I'll just wait. You think I'm a fucking novice? Bro, oh, I've played this game like, countless times. Oh, did I click that? Yeah, I did the knife. I said to do it. Yeah. Someone completed the game in three hours. It wasn't even a speed. What's that again? Someone did this. It wasn't even finished. It wasn't even a speed run. Three hours. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I've seen people speed run it. Like this guy called Joshy Muse. He sped run it in fucking hell. What was it? Seventeen minutes or something. It was something fucking mad. Oh, you know. 
Oh wow, there's my vehicle smoking already. Like that. That's just great, isn't it? I'm gonna die. Shows are far away from that. There it is. Mmm. Mmm, it's going to have it. You enjoy that, I am I don't want to be a streamer. Yeah. Turn on to your gameplay. You're like, look, you're gameplay. Oh, yeah. You're Some fucking kids screaming all loud outside. And it's probably fucking next door but one because I can see him walking down the alleyway. Oh, next, actually, next door but two. No, I just wondered what it was. I just didn't know it was quite a state. Yeah, Hi, I'm cool, Dodo. It is for women too. I'm shipping with my mate from the Yakuza Dojo. He's got the perfect Chinese flow flow. He just got a 30,000 past in the back. Because he's chilling with the best of the best of the best of the best of the best. And he found a hidden package. Listen, don't try to pimp out my listeners. That is a very ugly word. A travesty. I work miracles, senor. Not pimping. I say, I give the passion back. And you better wash yourself, buddy. Because for my people, no, I take not. these issues very personally. And huh? then, you no longer Mr. Talk Show. You Mr. Who cut up my tongue. I think it's me. Who are your people anyway? I mean, <laughs> which exotic location do you come from? I, uh, anyway, I am Latin. Latin. <laughs> Latin is a big I'm place there, buddy. Well, uh, we're in Latin. You are? I do not need to listen to the episode. I, 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 I have a calling. Many are called, but few Why on are earth would Mike ever watch my stream? Well, why would he? That's the question. Yeah, I think he'd like, he'd like it. You think Mike would like watching me streaming GTA? Yeah. Well, I beg to differ. If only. Mm. Yeah. Look at that. The most high quality thing in the game is an image of Rockstar. Well, look at the quality of the airplane. Yeah. And look at the fucking yeah, image. Yeah. Why is it like that? Fuck that. I'm going to 
chillin' and watch your stream, yeah? Mm-hmm. You wanna chill and watch your stream? Yeah, man. Take a laser, Jake. Oh, that's I'll see you soon. See you around. It is impossible to overestimate the importance of etiquette in this line of work. Okay, to my eternal shame, a man will give me a favor, and I have never had the opportunity to repay his kindness. The man's weakness is Mothercar, and he has requested that we acquire him certain models for his collection. Needless to say, we must give him the cards as a gift to repay the debt that I owe him. Take you on, motherfucker. obtained the cars on this list and delivered them to a garage behind the car park in Newport. My honor demands it. Fuck off, I forgot what I'm supposed to be doing. What are you talking oh, about, man? I'm starting to believe that guy about the fluoride in the drinking water. Listen, if there's any sane person left in Liberty City that can hear my voice, please call the show right now. This is an SOS going out across the city. All right, let's go over to this line. Hello, caller. You are on the air. Are you sane? <laughs> are you a sane caller? Absolutely, Lazo. Killer bees. K killer bees. Yes, killer bees. Did you know that if the current migration north continues, we will all be dead in three years? Did you want to become a bee stepper? I don't. That's why we must act now. Killer bees must be stopped. I wonder why more people oh are talking about Oh my god, that was case. close. Killer bees swarming it sounds pretty serious. Ah, but the killer bees are nothing compared to ants. You can't kill them. They're like sheep. They're going to take over. All right, thanks, caller. Ants, killer bees, fat people, what's plaguing you? Call now. Chatterbox, hello, you're on the air. Uh, yes. I'd like to say something about these damn people on trains and buses in the city who yammer on and on into their cell phones. I'm... Organization's called crap. What, what kind of moron are you? You, you want to round people up for using a phone, but you're you're calling up on a phone to, to tell the world about it. I mean, how many people are there in this crap? Citizens are raging against phones, Laszlo. How many people? There are three of us. It's hard organizing meetings without the phone, though. We've had to resort to carrier pigeons, and they keep disappearing. What are you speaking to me on? What's it, what's that in your hand? I am not the problem. You are, and you're perpetuating the downfall of mankind. Liberty City was great before phones ruined everything. Liberty City was a church, a cow pasture, and three houses when the... No, I'm like all ready for Christ's There's sake. an easy solution. Sue your boss. See, the great thing about this country is you can sue anyone for pretty much anything, and you'll probably win, or at least get a settlement. 
At the firm of Rakin and Ponser Personal Injury Attorneys, we can show you how falling down and howling like a sissy can result in a large damage award from your employer. We also specialize in awards for injuries suffered in auto, bus, and train accidents, and can even train you to throw yourself in front of a bus and pretend to be injured. Hey, that's why they pay for insurance. Call the law offices of Rakin and Ponser and get ready to enjoy a life of luxury. All right, we're back on Chatterbox. Let's uh, go to the chatter line here. Hello, caller. You're on Chatterbox. Laszlo, I just wanted to make your viewers aware that... Okay, now, this is a radio show. We don't have viewers. We have listeners. Uh, okay. Any... Because I went the wrong way. The reason we fucked up was because um, I didn't realise I'd started the mission and I was on my phone. So I'd already lost like a good minute or so. So I'm gonna have to try back to the mission. Maybe it. Shouldn't take me too long. I do apologise. Potsovernight.com, delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. It is impossible to overestimate the importance of etiquette in this line of work. To my eternal shame, a man once did me a favor, and I have never had the opportunity to repay his kindness. The man's weakness is motor cars, and yet requested that we acquire him certain models for his collection. Needless to say, we must give him the cars as a gift to repay the debt that I owe him. You must obtain the cars on this list and deliver them to a garage behind the car park in Newport. My honor demands it. Well, your honor can fuck off. Soon can do me and you are going to have a big problem on our hands. Yes, we're not going to be the Gary Hall. Gotta holler first at you, thirst master. I can 
too fly, we curse at you. Walk on by, fool, my sun shines, turning the clouds. I'm a teaser behind shootouts, burning the styles in the bridge. Cool out, my niggas wild. At award shows, I spit in the crowd. On your girlfriend wig, meet again because the world ain't big. And when you do, you duck, you earl, or play sick, basic flows. You got the block flocking to me. Oh, wow, just a little bit about my government, but not in the street. Love it, every minute of it. Spins is coming, and if it ain't real, then pretend to love it. Holla at you. For my man stretch on the undisputed champ. Uh, Joe, we bang him like this. Joe, Joe, Pellegrino. It's casting and nice now. Yeah. Check this, I'm probably the illest MC, believe it or not. Speak from the heart, disagree, let's meet at the park. You better rock some men's shoes and take a leap from a yacht. To be that bullseye, I penetrate with the lethal is done. Hush, puppy, you a team dog, need trees for the bar. What bird that hands out your drawers, you're reaching for... I let you find it dope, it's leaving this shot. Feeling this time, my head kicked back, but battling like heat when it's far. Sir... of love in a box directly to your Forget about air conditioning and modern medicine. We've got all the oh, nature wow. spells and potions you need at the Medieval Millennium Fair. Learn the art of cooking with turnips. Yum yum. Buy genuine reproduction medieval artifacts, including maces, double-handed battle swords, and one-size-fits-all chainmail. And this weekend only, pick up an authentic mechanical Lady of the Lake in Excalibur. It's perfect for your garden pond or swimming pool. And learn how to rid your condo of vermin using a penny whistle and a mysterious prancing German named Hans. The medieval millennium fair every...
schauen. Wow, thank you very much mate, thank you. You know, that's just what I wanted. To lose all my weapons. Wait, bear with me a second guys. Sorry about that everyone, I was just uh, downstairs grabbing some Maltesers and an Oculus. Big up an Mmm, that's nice. Head down to Bedford Point where you can see... You want knowledge? Don't get yourself the science. Enjoy my magic. A quick little skin. Forty way ground. Over this music, then you can definitely hear me over something this else. This is Michael like Hunt on Head Radio, owned by Love Media, making so right sure radio in every town in America radio. sounds exactly the same. Number one for noise. Can you hear that thunder? Head Radio. Would you like a kitten? Oh Have God, one delivered. Just log on to petsovernight.com and we'll send you a cute kitten overnight. Pets. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright. Right, so I've just I've just changed it now. So is that better? Like, can you hear me better now? Um, just yeah, that's better. So the thing is, 
though, I'll give you massive sound effects. You what? Max the sound effects and music. Max the sound effects and music? Yeah. Fucking hell. I'll be real loud on my air, uh, mate. Oh, I hate this stuff. Are you ready to party? These boys certainly are. And I hear the lead singer's out of therapy and ready to date your whoa, sister. Whoa, it roll loud? You don't have to do it that loud. You just said to max it. <laughs> I mean, match it, match it. Well, how am I supposed to know how loud my voice is? Sorry, mate. So you go on mute. Do it, do it as, as you've had it. Just then, sorry, mate. I didn't mean that. <sighs> Right. So if I turn my music down to about there, is that better now? Right, so if I turn it down to like there, yeah. I'll just turn the sound effects down. So is that a lot better now? Can you hear me now, like properly? You up? So you can hear me fine, yeah? Yeah. Alright. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna miss it, you know. I think you should do the mode in GTA 3 and GTA and like setting time graves. I will do and then I'll do 5. Yeah. But I'll do 5 on. Listen, I'll. I'll do GTA 5 on PS5. Because, uh. When it comes out on the next gen PlayStation, honestly, mate, the game's gonna be sick in it, GTA 5. It's coming out on Xbox as well, Yeah, but that's what I'm saying, when it comes to next gen, like, it's gonna be so sick. Mm. It's gonna run so smooth, the game. Mm. And it'll have better graphics. Mm. I'll be buzzing if they create, like, a fucking story mode DLC for GTA 5. Yeah, fair when I have to get all the trophies again. Yeah. Also, can I do the GTA 4 stream? Yeah. Can I actually put on the title sponsors? Uh, this, uh, this is tied in with the Alex GTA, Alex GTA series. Can I put that in the title? Not in the title, you put it in the description, Zach. Because if you put it in the title, it's, it just sounds daft. <laughs> no, because it's going to be too long. People aren't going to fucking open the video just to read the title, are they? <laughs> okay, no. You do what you want to do. You do what you want to do, or what you need to do. But yeah, honestly, GTA 5. Um, that was an amazing game, and when it does come out on next gen, honestly, it's going to be so, so much better. Like, I'll, I reckon I'll probably smash GTA online all the time again. Do you think it'll be cross platform? No. Why? Mate, they'll never make GTA cross platform, I don't think. I wish they did. Right. It'd be awesome if they did. They might do. Honestly, if Activision did it. Yeah, but Rockstar's a fucking way bigger company than Activision and all them. Yeah, I know, but still. Oh my god, I found a trash master. You know where I've got to go now, don't you? Yeah, but for the. Uh, for you. Put the buses in the wrong. Take care, that's a lock-up. Yeah, alright. Yeah. Right. 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 Right.
Yeah, so, uh. Yeah, crash my trash master there. Yeah, so what I'll do is I'll go and take this to Portland. For anyone who's watching and doesn't know what I'm doing. And, uh, we can get rid of it off the list. And while we're on that side of the island, we'll check for an open ambulance. An open fire uh, engine. Fire truck. Hello, I'm Donald Love. Under my guidance, Love Media has emerged as the fastest growing US run media conglomerate of the past five years. Oh, what are two cars doing? Radio stations across the US went into one way and then went into the other. a wide array of industrial and technology interests. We at Love Media ensure you get the truth behind the story every time. From films to dog food, from radio to pop music, you can be sure of independent, quality led broadcasting every time you tune in. That's why we're the fastest growing cable supplier and health insurance provider in the Northeast. And why our new satellite is shining something all Americans can be proud of. Here at Love Media, we are proud of what we have done to help America and to help hard-working Americans relax. For investment opportunities or information about our new interactive television service, please go to www.lovemedia.tv. Ooh, that makes me feel all warm and fuzzy. All right, let's go to line eight. Hello, caller. What's your name? Bob. Bob from Pine Creek. Hey, uh, what's up, Bob from Pine Creek? Well, I've been listening to your show. There's always people going on about problems. Ooh, gum. People don't disrespect you. So next we'll get the blister and the rumpo, depending on which one comes first. I've got a blister in the garage on Staunton Island as like a backup, even though they are extremely common. Oh, I'm on. I'm not sure I don't have to take this one. I'm pretty sure I don't have to make sure. 
Being a mom is hard with soccer, football, and lacrosse practice. So we bought the new Maifatsu Monstrosity. It's so big. We lost little Joey in the back and couldn't find him for an hour. When I'm rushing to the mall or talking on my cell phone, I know me and my family are safe. The Maibatsu Mon... It can cross rivers. So far, I've only hit a few puddles. But it's good to all know right, it's so there. With the time I save, got all around the back. The we've got our health back. I can focus on the important we've things. delivered a few vehicles like in the sun on that. At the pool boy or buying more exercise equipment off the yeah. TV. So we'll quickly go and check again just to make sure. I'm a mom, oh, we can't get into not ambulance. a conservationist. The new my Batsu um, monstrosity. Mine is bigger. Apart from that, I think we're pretty much done on this side. Would you off. like a giraffe? Have one delivered. Just log on to PetsOvernight.com and we'll send you a giraffe overnight. PetsOvernight.com. Delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. All right, you are listening to Chatterbox, hosted by me, Laszlo, because I got kicked off the rock station. Young man. Hmm, Laszlo got kicked off the rock station, did he? I was going to turn left hand, but then I realised I'm going to do the uh, first, not the one that's not left here. Yeah. Right, so that's an ambulance, a police car, a fire truck. I think I need to get the armoured police vehicle now. Just make sure. station is now box where your opinion matters or at least we say that let's go over here to line four hello caller what's your name jeff from rockford hello jeff what's up i want to tell you and your listeners about a once in a lifetime chance to make a difference it's a rally car you think it's a car starting at seven 
Although we'll be painting banners and singing songs all night and all day to prepare for it. Then, when tens of thousands have gathered in the park, we're going to march on the town hall. Glad all the people have spoken. They have said, no, not in my town. So folks, if you're listening and want to make a difference, get yourself down to the park and prepare to bring democracy back to the city. So, what's this rally about, Jeff? It's about people standing up and being counted. It's about the future. It's about telling those flaws. Don't say, not in my town. Not while I have a flesh in my body and hope in my soul. I will not, I cannot let this pass. Let what pass? It's about grabbing the town by the ball and saying, listen, son, I have a foot of a shutter. No more Mr. Nice Guy. No more easy solutions to difficult problems. It's about what it means to be in America. It's about giving something back. Giving what? Back? Hope, hey, hey. dream, belief. Belief in what? I mean, look, Jeff, I, I admire your passion, really, I do, but what will people be marching for? What, what's your rally about? It's about justice, Mr. Lowe, a chance to shine and make a difference. About thousands of people walking side by side in front of the marches. Only one thing on them, a chance to make a difference. Bring your friends. Nothing shows a man how much you need more than a chance to walk together for justice. Bring your kids. They can paint signs, believe in a face painter, and a vegan barber. Bring your parents. Elderly care about tomorrow. I understand that. It sounds like a great rally, but we're not a political station, and you haven't really told us why people should do this. What is it about? Look, look, you want to help or not? I don't know what I'm helping. You're helping America. What kind of people are you? That's the point. This is where it was. You don't know what it's for, do you? It's for so it's just over here. He'll be real good. All right, you fight the power, brother. Say later on in the show, if you're into uh, I think I or martial arts, we'll have a special guest just for you. This guy's really special. Kind of like a romantic cruise, but you can't walk on water. All right, let's go to the phone. Hello, caller. You're on Chatterbox. Huh? <laughs> you're on Chatterbox. What's on your mind? Oh, yeah, I wow. I can't believe it. <laughs> Do you have a question? Dude, I call every day and I never get through. Amazing. You do a great show, man. Thanks. What's uh? What, what what what's up? Oh man, I'm serious. Really great. You're like a total inspiration. And exactly what have I inspired you about? Well, okay. Right now, I live at home. Oh, well, I'm going down, dude, guys. Like, next week, dude. I'm moving I'm going out. Down. It's, uh, the big 4-0, and it's just it's just time to go. Okay. Did you have anything relevant to say? Yeah, dude. That B dude was bogus. Really bogus. Ah, oh, yeah. That's I think that was the PlayStation was calling. I appreciate that. <laughs> Come back from these messages that help supplement my meager salary. We're going to talk to Reed Tucker. Things. It's going to be a great interview. We'll be right back. A good shoe starts from the ground up. At Eris, we make high quality footwear. In fact, you can find Eris running shoes in over 140 countries around the world. In the past, there's been some criticism about our workers. That's why I'm here at one of the Eris factories so you can meet some of them. Excuse me, sir. Do you enjoy your job here? It's fun. We get to play with knives. That's fine, I think it's fine, nice. Oh, I I'm really sorry about the alarms, guys. I made a doll. I know a lot. That's the kind of dedication we have to our employees really and the quality of our shoes. Eris running shoes. Always running from something. Buying a gift for the guy that has everything? Is there anything I can think of just getting arrested? We've got exotic so things galore, including the drill. tigers, cobras, Manatees and white rhinos. All delivered overnight. Petsovernight.com delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. Yeah. All right, now joining us in the studio, we have a very special guest. His new book, Karate and Digestion, has been in the top 100 self help books for the past three weeks. He is the founder of Now in Zen Dojo and Organic Food Market in Trenton. His name is Reed Tucker. Welcome to Chatterbox. Oh, uh, by the way, this is the Lifted Bridge I was on about. I want the, uh, the Callahan Bridge. It was this one. Martial arts and organic food. I mean, it's kind of like putting ice cream on so pizza. Lifted up. Great, but so it's all the same. Okay, that's though. Ice cream is nothing like ice cream with pizza. Ice cream is milk based, as we all know, and I am lactose intolerant. And pizza, as you may know as well, is a sandwich derivative of Italian origin, but I won't go on. Martial arts are about this. Junk food. You have to explore your mind and your digestive system, Laszlo. What you put in also comes out. Especially corn. What you up to? 
Oh, fuck. I forgot it was this. Hi, I'm Candy, one of the sexy game girls. You can catch all of us lovely ladies doing our thing at hiphophoneys.com. It ain't no thing but a chicken wing with a big butt laying on your lap. Game radio, you listen to Lord Sears, Puerto Rican and black. Having a good time, drinking the wine. Every time, it's play time. Over here at Game Radio, y'all. And check us out at GameCrib.com, y'all. Oh my god, I saw it, oh. I want the car to drive away. So I don't bother about trying it. I just want to go through. Oh, I fucking do. Motherfucker. Like oh, they got a fucking headbutt. There you go. I'll fucking boat you in your family. Give me your motherfucking $25. Oh, fucking gave you permission to fucking help him. Yes, there's the cops. Your ass is mine, huh? Come arrest me, bro. <clears throat> why are you not arrest? I was gonna say, why are you not arresting me? I thought you were just gonna kill me. Yes, we're here. So it's in Torrington. Yeah, so it's just to the side of Kenji's. Alright, okay. Oh, right, right, right. It's this one.
guys will control that. FBI car, Barracks, OL, and Rhino. There's the three hardest ones. But once I do get the last three, I get a $200,000 bonus. Hello, caller. You are on the air. Hello, Reed. I so we will get them, but we just won't be doing it. Why, thank you. I want to ask about chapter 29. We'll have to do that yoga, not yogurt. I just can't give up cheese. So wonderful. So we've got all the candy now. We'll just have fun since the game now. So let's go. Let's do a mission for Andy. Carnivore, why don't you go gnaw on a bone like a gorilla, lad, low? Our ancestors didn't eat chicken wings. They lived at one with nature and their ecosystem, subsisting on a diet of nuts, berries, and leafy vegetables. Yes, and they threw stones to their own shadow and died of old age and fear at 24. Lad, low, the soul is eternal. But let me answer the question. When I'm in trouble or tempted by those all-you-can-eat breakfast buffets and juicy bacon... Can we get some bacon in here? Lad, low, I go back to bacon. I start the day with a fruity beverage from meditation. Do you wonder why the uh, screen goes like that into first person view? It's because uh, we can't do a top down view because the camera's been blocked by a building. And who wants a steak after world. that? Okay, next caller, you are on Chatterbox with Reed Tucker. Yo, Reed, so I think I'm full of through that tunnel, so that'll be blocked me. Okay, first things first, my man, you need to stop. Deal, steal. Oh. I think I remember this mission actually. When trouble looms, the fool turns his back, while the wise man faces it down. The Colombian cartel have ignored repeated requests to leave our interests in liberty well alone. Now they are negotiating terms with the Jamaicans in order to humiliate us further. They are finalizing a deal across town. Take one of my men, steal a yard car, and go pay your respects to the Colombians. Our honor demands that you leave no one alive! You see, I once thought like you were before my master. He took me under his wing and taught me the joys of soy and origami. What your language begins in the mind and spreads to Not all these extremes of the body. You must use the language of the body. Not the tongue, but the language of the body begins to draw from the southern fish. Just look at me. So I'm going to do something with that over and after you call her. Chop this, desk desk in this desk is made of two inch thick composite wood pulp as a mahogany.
go through it with the tofu with your bean curry, buddy. Very funny, though. You make fun of me for all the fault of the phone swing here. It's downright disgraceful. You have to make you talk like this. Okay, the listener lines are open. This is Chatterbox. You're all here. Hey, Lesler. Stand by the side with a listener. Where do you think I'm up from? The state season? That wacko you had going on about killer weed. What a moron. I mean, just read a newspaper. Killer weed. Uh, they pull some artificial sweeteners and soda pops in Roswell. It's all part of the government's propaganda plan. I might as well wear a satellite dish so they can use their propaganda right into my you brain. Don't anything Come on, you do honestly believe in it? So you do And then he moves from Woody City to San Andreas, like my second family, where CJ meets him. And I tell you, and working CJ here beats the hell out of digging sewage ditches outside Kuala Lumpur. All right, let's go to the phones. Hello, caller. You're on your own. Well, old man, I was listening to that English when you were talking to earlier. I mean, do these guys realize how good they sound? I mean, they have yeah, the nerve to call crackers this. And they say aluminium instead of aluminum. I mean, what's up with that? They all think they sound so smart with a little funny accent. I mean, I got something for them. Speak English, you limey moron. Well, you know, I think they were speaking English before we were. The people over here were speaking Shoshone and Cherokee. Man, Cherokee spared you, man. And, and another thing, what's up with them calling soccer football? Man, you, you ever watch soccer? Man, that's a boring game, man. I'll tell you what soccer is. Soccer's for little girls, man. Football, now that's an American sport. It, it teaches you good, wholesome American values, man, like like stealing other oh, people's well, land by force and, and wearing tight pants while you do. What are you talking about? To be truly strong, it is important that you never feel weakness. The business is fortunate enough to weakness. have our protection. Settle their accounts today. No worries. Go and nice collect money immediately. Again. So we Cheers can enter into the casino account. Cheers for tuning in. And I will uh, see you on the next part of the game. Because I think what we'll do is, is we'll, uh, we'll do this mission and then we'll leave it here. We'll go and save the game and we'll leave it for another chapter. Speaking of commerce, it's time for some commerce here. Let's go to commercials. We'll be back after this. Has your marriage gone stale? Has the spark gone out of your love life? Looking to add a little adventure to the monopoly of monogamy? I think this is where we're going to find you. Fernando Martinez, founder of Fernando we understand how two kids with a mortgage can take the passion out of your life. When you do a three-step program, no, you'll read the store wrong. This is a hard one. You'll be there! We'll be the first car.
some of that stuff. Let's have a little more dog. Now, what you say is you say, please, Aris, more dog, please. No fighting between man and man. Let your love grow strong. Kaja, up all night long. I'm the pacifier. And this is from Green Sleep. I wouldn't pay you if I could. Some young gang just tracked up the place. They took everything. You guys are useless. What kind of Yakuza are you anyway? Please tell me there's a boat, yes. I always hate jumping from this boat. It's horrible to jump on this game. Thinking it's the Diablos that have um, been hurting him. I could be wrong though, it could be the Triad. It looks like it could be the Triad area, but it's, I don't think it is actually. No, I think it is definitely the Diablos. Behind me, honking his flashing his light. Then he gets over this mega. 
makeup on oh. and says, this is a woman in the steel my boss do monstrosity. Side of the map, the more we need to just drop it off. Never come back again. Plus, I also need some armor, so it helps me going down there. There's benefits to everything. Right now. So, secure a car, blister. Flatbird, Line Runner, Dodo Boss, Rumpo, and Mr. Walker. car.
mean old scientist genetically altered him. Uh oh, the pharmaceutical scientist is going to get you, Pogo. Here you go, Pogo. Have a gold coin. Good thing Pogo has banana cannon. Those nasty scientists deserve to die. Now get the shampoo manufacturers before they squirt it in your eye. Here you go, Pogo. Have a diamond. You'll guide Pogo to tons of fun adventures, including saving Timmy, who fell down the well. Help! <laughs> Here you go, Pogo. Have a big watch. Rescue a cat out of that tree with your banana cannon, Pogo. Here you go, Pogo. Have a fast car. Help Pogo to his final mission. To storm the White House with his friends and become president of the United States. Pogo the Monkey is the game kids are sure to stare at for hours. Everyone loves Pogo. Idiot Gamer called Pogo the best spring and simian game since Bouncing Bananas. Buy the game Pogo the Monkey today. Right, Pogo? And coming soon, Pogo the Monkey card game, Pogo the Monkey plastic dolls, Pogo the Monkey quilt covers, and Pogo the Monkey car covers. If it analyzes everything, why not a Pogo the Monkey tiny sports jacket? But the lady in your life, why not Pogo the Monkey chocolate and hygiene products such as Pogo the Monkey? And for kids, a life-size, living, breathing, springing monkey. All available at PogoTheMonkey.com. Minutes of music guaranteed. As soon as you wait through another nine minutes of messages from our sponsors. Lips 106. I'm a marketing manager who lives in the suburbs and commutes to work on the highway. I live alone, so of course I needed a car that could. Fitting you should choose this moment to sow your worst state. It would appear your attempts to dissuade the Jamaicans from becoming bedfellows with the cartel were wholly inadequate. Yardy pushes line Liberty Street selling packets of spank like they were selling hot dogs. Those cartel pigs are laughing at you. At me, I will give you one last chance to prove my sister's faith in you to be well founded. Run these scumbags into the ground and wash your shame in rivers of our enemy's blood!
so, I mean, sir, you know, in life we have a lot of obligations. We just kind of have to face up to them. And right now, I'm obligated to play some commercial announcements. We'll be back right after this. We've got a new friend for everyone. He's got fur and a tail. He gets in lots of trouble, but he's a bouncy little fellow, because he's got springs for legs. Hogo the Monkey, the best new video game for the whole family. I love you, Hogo. You found. Help Pogo escape the evil research laboratory to the mean old scientist genetically offered him. Uh-oh, the pharmaceutical scientist is going to get you, Pogo. Here you go, Pogo. Have a gold coin. Good thing Pogo has a banana cannon. Those nest. I think we're going to leave it there guys thank you for watching as always it's greatly appreciated um, yeah hope you all enjoyed we'll, uh, we'll get on it next time and uh, yeah alright we'll see you all in a bit thanks for joining